Blessed assurance, Jesus is mine. Oh, what a foretaste of glory divine. Heir of salvation, purchase of God. Born of His Spirit, washed in His blood. My dear friends, brothers and sisters, I greet you all in the matchless name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. In our short meditation today, let us see from the Bible that we can get rid of our guilt. Yes, my beloved people, get rid of your guilty feeling. The Bible says we need not have a guilty feeling when we are cleansed with the blood of Jesus Christ. When our sins are cleansed with the blood of Jesus Christ. Isaiah chapter 53 verse 5 says, The chastisement of our peace was upon him. Yes, my beloved people, he was punished so that we can have peace. So we need not have a guilty feeling of our sinful life. The Bible clearly tells this that we need not carry the guilty feeling in our life all through our life because Jesus has cleansed our sins and he has bore all the iniquities what we have committed. First John chapter 1 verse 9 tells that when we confess our sin, he cleanses us and he takes all our guilty feelings and the sins are washed away. Yes, my beloved, when we are confessing our sins, the God is merciful that he cleanses our sins and he takes all our guilty feelings. So we need not feel guilty of our sins when we are a child of God. My dear friends, when Christ has set us free from guilt and sin, why we need to walk with guilty feeling? He has given us a life that we can enjoy without any guilty feeling. So enjoy your life without any guilty feeling. Beloved people, let us remember one thing. Every sin will follow a guilty feeling. That is a human attitude. But after being forgiven by our Lord Jesus Christ through his blood, we need not carry the guilty feeling. But let us see the example of Cain. Even before getting the forgiveness of sins, he didn't have the guilty feeling of killing his brother. So let us not have that kind of attitude that we do not have a guilty feeling of committing the sins even before getting forgiveness. See, Cain's heart was hardened that even when God came and told him that your brother's blood came and spoke with me that he was killed, Cain didn't realize and didn't have a guilty feeling. So let us not have that kind of attitude that before getting the forgiveness of sins, we lack the guilty feeling. But after receiving the forgiveness of sins from our Lord Jesus Christ through his blood, we need not have a guilty feeling. The Bible clearly tells that. Isaiah chapter 1 and verse 18 tells us that though our sins are like scarlet red, it will be transformed as white as a snow. So we need not have the guilty feeling. Hebrews chapter 8 and verse 12 says, I will not remember any more about your sins after you have been forgiven. So the God clearly tells that after we have been forgiven, he will not remember any more any of our sins. My dear people, see, Cain didn't have the guilty feeling about killing his brother. His heart was so much hard and that even God came and told him that your brother's blood came and spoke with me. But still he didn't have the guilty feeling. So before getting forgiveness from the God, we should have a guilty feeling of committing any sin. But the Bible clearly tells, we need not carry all throughout our life the guilty feeling when we have received the forgiveness from God through the blood of Jesus Christ. Yes, my beloved people, Isaiah chapter 1 and verse 18 tells that, though our sins are like scarlet red, after receiving the forgiveness from God, they are transformed as, as white as snow. So we need not carry the guilty feeling, my dear beloved people. Hebrews chapter 8 verse 12 says, After getting the forgiveness of sins from our God, he tells that, I will not remember any more about your sins. So we need not carry the guilty feeling in our life about what the sins we have committed. But my dear beloved people, Ezekiel 3.18 tells, we should have a guilty feeling. This one kind of guilty feeling everyone should have. 
if we see a person who, one who is in sin and we do not tell him that he is sinning or we do not tell him the gospel of christ for him to be saved then we should have the guilty feeling the bible tells so we should have a guilty feeling when we are not telling someone who is sin that he can be forgiven by the blood of jesus christ finally my brethren second corinthians chapter 5 and verse 17 tells that when we are in christ all the old things are passed away and we are a new creation so we need not carry the feeling of guiltiness we need not feel guilty let us throw away our guilty feelings it is god's will that you must be saved first listen to the bible truth and you must believe the truth then you must repent from your sinful life then you must confess by words that the lord jesus christ as the son of god you must be baptized for the remission of your sins every day our lord added those who were being saved into his church be blessed by studying the word of god to receive the voice of truth international magazine and to study the bible systematically through our english bible correspondent course kindly write to us our address gracious word po box 15 Arsradi Madurai 625016 Tamil Nadu For more details dial 9244204420 9244214421 God bless you The Church of Christ salutes you